first tin down. Smear in the other tin. Um, take a in here. Get that hand out of the way. This hand. Yeah. Right, so, grafting. I actually don't like that one, so I'm going to redo that one. Okay, so. Little thing fussy. Get all this trouble. Uh, you don't want to waste them. So it's a nice graft, pick it up. Sitting in, sitting in royal jelly, you just gently push it off the cell. So, what we've got here is just one of these little Chinese made grafting tools. You can buy them on eBay for uh, 10 for $10 or something. They're just a little simple mechanism. Sliding blade with a little flat tongue. Um, the tongue goes down, follows the cell wall down, picks up the, the grub with the jelly, and then the little thing pushes it off. Um, got our queen bar, we've got 20 bars per cell. We've set up, we're grafting four cell raisers today, which is uh, three per cell raiser, 60 cells, so uh, 12 Good. bars. So we're grafting 12 bars of cells. I've got a frame of brood out of my our breeder, I've um, got a Caucasian breeder which we're grafting out of um, here today. This is uh, one of Joe Horner's breeders. Um, occasionally you have that happen. Um, and I just drop the, gently drop the... So, what we used to do is wet the cells with honey. Uh, we found if you can get enough royal jelly on the March flies, buggers. Um, grafting tool. On the grafting tool, you don't need honey. And you'll get a, a much better strike. And I've got a bloody uh -huh. March flies. Here are bad. We're up in the snowy mountains at the moment. Um, grafting. Queens. Good one hand in the That's it. The only thing is with these are a little bit fiddly. Just sometimes, once you get them adjusted right, um, they run really nice. And if you do it right, you don't have to actually touch the, the larvae because you pick up, you're scooping up the larvae with the royal jelly and the, and the grub. The, the larvae is floating. And we're pushing off the larvae. Just push it off into there. Probably can't see it, but um, and it's still floating. So I haven't actually touched the lava. So if you get it right, there's no reason why you can't get a strike out of 20, of, you know, 18, 19, or even 20. Um, the ones we did yesterday, we had several bars that we had 20, 20 take. Uh, no one's done. So we get it in the hive as quickly as possible because the raw jelly does dry out pretty quick. <laughs> 